With typical line array elements, a vertical dispersion angle greater than zero degrees, nominal angle, is selected so that the resulting wavefront between the elements does not show any dips when the array is curved. This vertical dispersion angle causes the wavefronts of the different elements to overlap at all angles except the nominal angle. Only with a vertical dispersion angle of zero degrees is the wavefront completely cylindrical. Nonetheless, since typical line arrays have a vertical dispersion angle greater than zero degrees, the wavefront is always curved. At high frequencies, this leads to interference. When the sound pressure emitted by two line array elements reaches our ear, the sound waves have traveled slightly different paths in length. Due to this curvature of the wavefront, they overlap with difference in time alignment. Phase shifts arise in these areas. The addition of wavefronts with different phase shifts leads to a diffuse sound image and to loudness differences in the frequency response. DIPS, the COM filter effect. With WellTech, variable acoustic lens technology, for the first time it is possible to adjust the vertical dispersion angle of the individual element. For this purpose, the wavefront is more or less curved by two adjustable lens segments, whereby even a completely plain wavefront is possible. Zero degrees vertical dispersion. With WellTech, you can now adjust the angle of each element exactly to the mechanical curvature between neighboring elements. As a result, there is no overlap between the wavefronts of the different elements, resulting in a homogeneous wavefront. And no level differences in the frequency response. Optimal clarity The result of a homogeneous wavefront is a line array that behaves like a real point source. For further information about the VC line array with Well Technology or to make an appointment for a demo, go to www.veltechlinearray.com.